Hi, my name is Lisa and I'm one of the librarians at the Watauga County Public Library. And today I want to show you lots of fun activities that you can have around the letter K. That's right. The first thing I want to show you is a capital letter K and a lowercase letter K are very similar. The only thing that's different is this slanted line on the letter K. On the lowercase letter K, it's a little bit shorter than on the uppercase letter K. So they're a kind of tricky to tell which one's capital and which one's lowercase. We're gonna start out with our very first fun activity is going to be making a puzzle together. And I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you clues to words that start with the sound of letter K. So do you know what that sound is? If you go to school in Watauga County where our library is located, you're probably familiar with the letter land and you may be familiar with the k -k kicking king. So that's the sound of letter K, k, -k, -k kicking king. So those, the words, the clues that I'm going to give you will be to words that start with that k sound. All right. So the first clue I'm going to give you is you would need this if the door to the house or the car that you wanted to get in was locked. You would need a k, k to open the door. What would that be? Did you guess key? Key? All right, the next word that I want you to guess, this word rhymes with miss and hiss, but I want you to take that first sound of those words and replace that first sound with the k sound. So this, this word would rhyme with miss, hiss, but it's gonna start with k. Did you guess kiss? Very good. We'll put that right here. The next word that I want you to guess is, oh, this is something you would do to a soccer ball. What would you do to a soccer ball that starts with k, k? Would you kick it? All right, let's put that right here. And the next word, this is kind of an old fashioned word. We don't use it very much. But if you were to put, um, well, well, let me just tell you, it rhymes with metal. It rhymes with pedal, but it starts with a K. K, K, kettle. Did you know that a kettle is something you use to warm up water so that you can have a cup of tea? And there we've made our letter K with our puzzle. Do you think that letter K is an uppercase or a lowercase letter K? Look at it carefully. Did you guess lowercase? Because that slanted line is shorter than the first straight line in the letter. So it's more like the lowercase letter K. All right, so the next fun thing we're gonna do with the puzzle that we just made is we're gonna sing a song I'm gonna teach you and it goes like this. We are learning letter K, letter K, letter K. We are learning letter K, 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 k. And we do our arms like that because we would really be kicking our feet at the same time, like kicking king. So that's just an action to help you remember the kicking king sound for letter K. Now we want to sing a verse for each picture that's on our puzzle. So for instance, key, we want to make up an action to go with key. Can you think of something you might like to do? It can be anything. It can be silly and it can be um, not so silly. So you could talk with the grown-ups or other people in your house about what would be a fun action. I'm just gonna pretend like I'm turning a key, but you can pretend like you turned the key and pushed a door open or you turned a key and opened a door this way. However you wanna do it is fine but we want you to use that action while you sing the next verse, which would go like this. Key starts with letter K, letter K, letter K. Key starts with letter K. K, 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 K. Now I want you to pause this video and think of an action that you can do for each one of those pictures. Sing the verse that goes along with it, and then when you come back, I will have something to share with you, a book.
that has a letter K in the title. One of my favorite books that has a letter K in the title is called Bad Kitty. Can you find the letter K in the title of this book? Did you find it right there? Bad Kitty, and there is the letter K. And the thing that I love about this book, first of all, is I love the alphabet because the alphabet is so essential to helping you read. Um, and this particular book goes through the alphabet four times in a very silly way. So I found a video with the author, Nick Bruel, the man who wrote this book. He reads the, this book that he wrote. And I'm gonna link to that video in the description of this video so that you can listen to the story of Bad Kitty read by the author, Nick Bruel. So you can either pause this video and listen to the story or you can wait till the end of this video and then listen to some of the stories that I've linked to below. I wanna share a story with you that has a word that starts with letter K featured very prominently throughout the story. And the name of the story is How Kind by Mary Murphy. And there's our letter K right there. And the story goes like this. Hen gave pig an egg. How kind, thought the pig. Hen is so kind. I would like to do something kind for someone as well. And the pig thought about rabbit and he wondered what was something kind that he could do for the rabbit. What is something rabbits like? Do they like carrots? The pig got a carrot for the rabbit. And do you know what the rabbit said? How kind. Well, the rabbit was thinking about how kind the pig had been, and the rabbit wanted to do something kind for someone too. So the rabbit picked some flowers and gave those flowers to the cow. And the cow, what do you think the cow said? How kind. And the cow was thinking about how kind the rabbit had been. And the cow thought, I would like to do something kind too. And the cow thought about the cat. Do you know something the cat's like? The cow decided to give some milk to the cat. And do you know what the cat said? How kind. Well, the cat was thinking about how kind the cow had been. And the cat thought about the dog and the dog, and he thought about how much the dog liked to play chase. And so the cat went to the dog and said, would you like to play one of your favorite games? We could run around together. And the dog said, how kind. And they ran around together and had so much fun. And then the dog was thinking about how kind the cat had been. And the dog wanted to do something kind as well. So the dog went, and fetched a stick and the dog came and scratched the pig's back with the stick. And do you know what the pig said? The pig said, how kind. And then the pig said, dog, would you like to come see my egg? And what did the dog say? How kind. But when the pig took the dog to see the egg, the egg wasn't there anymore. Instead, oh, there was a little yellow chick. Well, the pig and the dog took the yellow chick back to the hen. And do you know what the hen said? How kind. Here are just a few books that have a letter K in the title of the book. If you see a kitten, cows in the kitchen, the koala who could, and a kiss means I love you. So I hope you'll look for some of these book titles at your public library. I'm also going to link to some stories in the video description that you can listen to that have the titles with the letter K and books that you can also find on NC Kids Digital. So make sure you check out the titles that have a letter K that will be in the video description. I wanted to show you something else that starts with a letter K. Do you know what this is called? It starts with a letter K and it is called a 
kaleidoscope. So I'm going to link to a video of a, what a, the inside of a kaleidoscope looks like. Did you think that was pretty cool? I think, I think kaleidoscopes are just beautiful and they start with the letter K. Almost as beautiful as kaleidoscopes are these beautiful kaleidocycles that you can make. Either check out the website and YouTube channel for how to fat or access this fun activity through the links in the video description below. Hope you'll have fun making your very own kaleidocycles. I have two more things that I'd like to show you that start with a letter K. The first one is, uh, do you know what this is? A koala. And the second one is a kangaroo. And these are my friends who've come to help me let you know that that's all we have for you today for our fun activities about the letter K. But there are many more activities linked in the video description. There are experiments, there are songs, there are crafts. So make sure you check out all those extra fun activities in the video description underneath this video. Well, that's all we've got for you today. In the words of Tigger, ta-ta for now. Be sure to click on the words Show More located underneath this video on YouTube to access links to more fun activities around the shape and sound of the focus letter in this video. If you're on a mobile device and you'd like access to those links, just click on the icon indicated here in the green circle.